And if you see, the minister perpetrated this fraud right from Sorry, please. The okay. Let me Dr. finish, Kach, please. You, you I own my word. Let me just speak finish. Let me talk. I beg you, I'm in Nigeria. You speak don't, with don't fact. You speak this, with facts. It is a fraud. Uh, decorum. To yeah, exactly. Try you have to, to speak Let with me fact. finish, please. When you try to do an agreement on behalf of your country, and then you don't show your country any agreement because writing those things in Chinese letters is because of the things that we saw happening in other African countries where the Chinese will come in gently pretending to be a development partner and the next day they go. I have it on a good authority. The Chinese are targeting the LNG. That's what they want. Those are allegations. Good. And if you are saying you want to sell Nigeria to China, for how much? 400 million. They said 400 million. We already got back from Abacha Lut and shared it according to him. Those are allegations. That's what we are Dr. Doing? Dr. Katch, I think, Listen, I think you should. My party, the PDP, will not allow, or because we did business with the Chinese, and we never wrote an agreement to give away our sovereignty. This thing was hidden. There were no prints that actually were written in English. It is simply because we've not taken those papers to go and reinterpret it that we have now found out that. Somewhere, somehow, Nigerians signed the agreement, signed Nigeria over to the Chinese to give our sovereignty to China. The Chinese are planning to take our LNG. That's what it is. They will not touch your military or diplomatic asset. Any other asset in the country is free. And of course, I agree the way my brother said. They will help you to fail. And once they fail, there's no arbitration. They take those things. And you start arguing, they will tell you they simply are implementing the letters of the agreement. And if you like what arbitration or not, they have that thing. So we don't want this. 400 million. Please, we don't want anything that will make Nigeria lose its sovereignty. Absolutely. We do not want anything. No, 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 please, we don't want. Nigeria will be going on our own pace. And nobody has said they want our sovereignty. What do you want tomorrow? Okay, tomorrow they will now close our oil fields. That is it now. Because they said, leave diplomatic, leave military assets. But who are we? The Chinese can overrun us. If they ever want to take anything and we say no, they will overrun us with their military because they have stronger military capability than we do. So why should we be this foolish? For me, the minister should resign. And the government should apologize to the people. And that's why I've been saying since that the president is not available to act, to guide the ship of state. And that's why you see all this is happening. 